Hi, I'm John Aldridge, inventor of the Bird of Prey Bicycle. I'm a licensed California architect. I live in Carlsbad, California, by the Pacific Ocean, here in beautiful Southern California. The Bird of Prey Bicycle is the fastest racing bicycle in the world. Well, I, I could do that laying down. Wow. <laughs> Thanks. I ride up and down the Pacific Coast Highway. I ride against fast bike riders. Fast bike riders. I race them. I love racing those bike riders. And I beat them. An old man like me beats them. Uh, I also love to race cars. Initially, there was some skepticism from my family and friends, and I wasn't allowed to even mention a bicycle. But eventually, when they saw the bike, they loved it. An obstacle I had in building the bike was finding someone to build it. I can't build the bike. I'm not a bike builder. I finally found Russ Denny, a bicycle builder who had been building bicycles for 35 years. I took drawings to Russ. They were just newspaper sketches rolls of newspaper. I was embarrassed to show it to him because I thought he would laugh. And then finally I did show it to him and he said he could build it. And he came up with a beautiful design, a beautiful build. Russ Denny calls me the test pilot. I've been riding this bike now for five years. The bike has been developed from experiences I've had while riding it. I guess I'm a, a bit of a daredevil. I've never crashed. I've gone as fast as 45 miles an hour downhill. It's easy to do. And I guarantee you it is a lot of fun to ride. It's a very comfortable bike. I came up with the concept because I was disappointed at how slow a bicycle goes when you're in the wind. I needed something that was aerodynamic and I thought of Getting down low. The reason it's easy to ride fast is because the Bird of Prey obviously is a very aerodynamic bicycle. The Bird of Prey bicycle is not a prone bicycle. It is a semi-prone bicycle. That means that you can, your body, you can see where you're going. Your head is up. You're not looking down at the pavement. The reason I designed the Bird of Prey bicycle is to make it aerodynamic because I was having trouble when I went downhill. The wind resistance was so strong. At 22 miles per hour, 80% of your pedaling power is spent just to overcome wind resistance. With a Bird of Prey bicycle, part of the way I designed it was that I held my hands up until they were just like comfortable. And I lifted my head until it was just comfortable right about here. And then I knew that I could just lay forward down on the bike. And that was the position that I, I finally ended up with, where I was laying far enough forward to be aerodynamic and I could see where I was going. When you swim in a swimming pool, you swim in a prone position. I never saw anybody sitting down swimming in a swimming pool. The Bird of Prey bicycle is a very safe bike. You cannot flip over the handlebars. On a normal sit-down, a standard sit-down bike, if you slam the brakes on, you'll flip right over the handlebars in a panic stop or when you hit a bump. I know it's happened to me many times. I'm lucky to be alive. But on a Bird of Prey bicycle, when you slam those brakes on in a panic stop, you just come simply to a stop. You do not crash. The the pedal power of a Bird of Prey bicycle is superior to that of a sit-down bike. On a sit-down bike, you're bent over at the waist. I never saw anybody run a foot race bent over at the waist, bringing their knees up to their chest. On a Bird of Prey bicycle, you're in a full layout position where you have the full power of your legs to pedal with. The Bird of Prey 
bicycle is geared for high speed. We have a 60 tooth chain ring and an 11 to 10 tooth rear cog. That gives you a lot of pedaling power. So the Bird of Prey bicycle is a marriage of aerodynamics, gearing, and body position, creating the fastest racing bike in the world. When people see the Bird of Prey bicycle, they always say, I've never seen anything like that before. And they're right. The Bird of Prey bicycle is the only modern prone bike. There are other prone bikes being built, but none of them have the geometry and the setup as the Bird of Prey bicycle. It's comfortable. People always ask me, they say, it does not look comfortable. I've had people drive by in cars and yell, ouch, out the window. You're not laying on your stomach. You're laying on the iliac crest, the upper prominent part of the hip bone. The Bird of Prey bicycle can be ridden by triathletes who want to improve their time. It can be ridden by people for pleasure and it can be ridden by people who have back pain. You people with chronic back pain that can't sit down on a bicycle can ride the Bird of Prey bike because they're laying down. You have no pressure on your spine. Just imagine what you could do on a Bird of Prey bicycle. So how does that feel? Yeah, it feels a little different, but I could probably get much good. Actually, it's really nice. My back feels fantastic. My shoulders feel good. The padding is really nice. I like the aerodynamic. I've got a nice leg extension on it too. <laughs> the sales for the Bird of Prey bicycle starts on December 1st, 2015. The day will come when we see Bird of Prey bicycles ridden by people all over the world. So it's time to fly on the Bird of Prey Bicycle.